everybody, Deborah here, also known as Doobage42. Welcome back to my channel, and it's time for my take. Now, on this week's my take, I was thinking about talking about politics and ranting about things, maybe turn signals, who knows. But today, I wanted to get back into the body positivity and my sort of journey with it. Um, I think I'm coming a long way. I'm posting videos on YouTube, which anybody who knew me back in the past would have said, oh, hell no, that's never going to happen. I post selfies on Instagram every day, much to the chagrin of my followers probably because it's makeup stuff and it's just me. And today, now mind you, I'm recording this on uh, Saturday, February the 11th. Today, I even posted a before and after side by side of makeup. So the before is zilch, nothing, nada, not even moisturizer and um, primer. So you see it all bare. And I'm putting that out into the public. What? Is it easy? No, it really isn't. Also, is it easy to keep this scarf where it belongs? No, not so much. But I'm trying. Every day, I'm trying to put myself out there a little bit and be positive, even though the, the little negative crap in your head still says, Oh, nobody wants to see that. Oh, nobody wants to look at you. Cover your head with a bag. I mean, my voices are pretty evil, but um, I'm still trying. And a lot of us are. You know, it's not just me, the fat girl with, you know, big self-esteem problems. It's everybody. Even that really super pretty girl that you see probably gets some hate. I mean, Lady Gaga was getting hate from her Super Bowl halftime show because she had a little smush of of belly, if you want to call it that. It was a little bit of skin showing up over her outfit, probably because she was in a harness from being swung in, but whatever. That's a woman that is in fabulous shape, super talented, and flipping awesome, and she still gets hate. How can someone like me hope to not get hate, you know? But I'm learning to, as they say, put on my big girl panties. And um, if the hate comes around, just try to let it roll off. No, it's not always easy. No, it's not always easy to keep a smile. But I find that, you know, keeping a smile helps me to be where I need to be in my head. So how is your body positivity going? Are you one of these people that just is super confident about everything and you know that you're awesome and all that in a bag of chips? Or are you kind of like me and you're like, mm, not so much all that in a bag of chips, but I'll try to ride in the cart next to them. I, <laughs> I don't know. I'm trying to be positive. I'm trying to be awesome. And every day, when I get a like on a video, you know what? That is a little bit of an ego boost. So if you want to make a big old girl happy, you know, click the like button. <laughs> Check out some of the body positivity sites as well, because there are some inspirational stories and people who just learn to get over their stuff or are learning to deal with their stuff, because I don't think you always get over things. The past sticks with you. And sometimes in ways you never thought it would. So I am here. I'm smiling, posting my videos, and uh, hoping to hear from you. Please like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time here on my channel. I'm Dubich42. See ya.